Hello, I'm Keith Warren, Chief Executive of the Food Service Equipment Association. We're unveiling our new name as the new face of the organisation as we represent the needs and the information requirements of the breadth of the food service equipment industry. This follows a year of transformation of the organisation, representing all the key areas of food service equipment. Hello, my name's Adam Lawrence. I'm the Marketing Manager at the FEA. This year at HRC, as you can see behind me, we have launched our rebrand. FEA stands for Food Service Equipment Association. The rebrand came out of our member research that took place in July 2018. Many of our members felt that they weren't represented by the term catering, it was too old fashioned. Taking on our member feedback, we've modernized the logo and also updated the name, but we haven't entirely dismissed all of what Caesar was. We've kept the color scheme the same, so that people still recognise that. But with the name change, we've broadened our appeal and future-proofed the organisation. With HRC being the launch of the rebrand, it's the first time that our members have actually been able to see the first public outing of the new logo. The feedback that we've had from the members has left everybody involved with the project absolutely thrilled about the look and feel and the modernisation of the brand. We launched at HRC because we felt that it was a point in time that set a natural deadline up until this point, we've trickled the branding through on the social media and the digital side of things. We've also had an awareness campaign in the trade press. Hopefully you've seen it. It seemed like a natural point to launch as the FEA. It is one of the biggest shows for the industry in the UK. As you can see, the branding is here. It's big, it's bold, and it's bright. The change recognises also the fact that we're still focused on the three eyes, the information that we can deliver that's industry specific, the involvement that we can give members in the relevant decision-making processes with the authorities and government bodies, and also the influence that that brings to future-proof the industry on behalf of our 200 members so that they can do more business more effectively within the market.